previously in Beholder 2. Today I would like to formally announce the new round of Super Game. To all teams taking part, welcome! Team Homeland, Evan Redgrave, John Smith, Gloria Murphy, Hank Wright. Oh, hello! Oh shit! <gasps> I don't want to work here anymore. We know that Anthony Salerno or Fat Tony is in the ministry. We really need to meet him with, to discuss an important matter. Get him to come out of the ministry. Hello, hello, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to Beholder 2, and has this game always looked like this? I guess it has. Okay. What am I supposed to do? Get promoted. Find the memory stick from somewhere? Yes. Okay, I think I'm gonna start by searching that. Why does this look so weird? Wait, I wonder if it was back at the Lost and Found. Could it have been back at the Lost and Found? That might be a good place for a memory stick. Is it here? Also, what the hell? I don't remember what I did last time. Okay, no, there's only hacking with terminals and a dress. Wait a minute. Get the information. No, 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 yes, yes, now I remember what I was going to do. I was going to stab M Mr. Salerno slash uh, John Smith in the back. Evan, Caramillo, have you checked the square? How are my old friends? Dead, I hope. Uh, tell him about the Mafia, don't tell him back. Um, I need the money, though. I won't tell him, I'm sorry. Apart from a pair of police trackers and a dozen onlookers, there's no one there. It all seems too easy, the Mafia knows how to hide. Are you sure the way is clear? Yes, absolutely sure. They're there to ambush you. Va bene, grazie, Evan. I'm ready to get going. I got money and I am... Um... Yeah, I'm horrible. Is that all? Okay, looks like that is all. Um, so yeah, now I'm gonna go and search through this whole building. Try to find the memory stick. That is somewhere here. Oh! Okay, so... We didn't get a cutscene. Sorry, what's going on here? That's been a murder. Who was murdered? Judging by his past, John Smith, an employee of the 12th floor. Yeah, that's my fault. His chest looks like a sea. They shot him almost point blank. Yep. Rip. But now I only have Hank Wright to get rid of. And John Smith withdrew from the race promotion. <laughs> yeah, withdrew. That is exactly the way to put it. Wait! I wonder if the cleaner Mr. knows where a memory stick could be found. Okay, and we're still in the lead. That's good. Hello, Carl. Carl of the workplace where John Smith used to work. Sorry, regulations say that I have to get back to work. Okay, I should actually get back to work also. But... Hank, I'm gonna check your... your desk. I've, I've probably done that already, but I will... I will sneak, sneak a little. Okay, there's nothing here. Let's, let's go away. Let's go away and find the cleaner. Cleaner, cleaner, cleaner. He might be the person who knows where to find a memory stick. 
Yes, Arthur Mitchell. Arthur Mitchell. Mitchell. Arthur. Hello. Hi, Arthur. Oh, hi. How did you know my name? It's me, Evan. We've already met. Ah, I see. You must have been in the bar yesterday when I was with my pals. Did you happen to see who tanned my hide so bad? How am I going to clean boss's office tonight? It's my first day, no less. What do you want? Um. Let's go about the shredder. Have you seen the shredder? What do you think of it? Terrible, terrible thing, I tell ya. All those blades. Everything is swimming in front of my eyes after yesterday. I've gotta get a grip before I fall over. Okay. You didn't know where to get a memory stick. How about in the filing cabinet? Come on. No. No. How about in the boss's office then? Come on. I think I've checked this also already, yeah. No. No memory sticks. No memory sticks. Can I... God damn. Oh! Oh! And here's Evan Redgrave. I've been waiting for you. Oh, we won the... Super game. Comrade Evan, your team won. You did a great job. Keep it up. A motivational reward has already been issued. And the losing team has already backed its belongings and left the ministry. Really? I didn't see. Why would you be looking in the shredder anyway? Okay. Task completed. That's cool. But I still need that memory stick. Where can I find it? You can't tell me anything. You're useless. Hmm. Selena, do you know anything? Ask where I can buy useful items. That career page says something for sale. There's also a merchant, but he might be hard to find. No, this was not Selena's voice. Serena's. Sorry. Do you know where I can find? He used to work. Okay, yeah, there we are. He used to work at 6 Krusevich Street, then moved past Le Leidenment Square. Enlightenment? No, Leidenment. The letters on the sign faded out, so they entered into the register like that. Look for him there. How will I recognize him? You'll know him when you see him. He wears an old fashioned top hat to make himself more noticeable from afar. You shouldn't have any problems. Okay, thank you. There we go. I've searched through this whole whole goddamn place and talked to everyone about where the hell I can buy a goddamn memory stick or find one. So now I can go home and then go outside and then then we will get this on. You are standing at the end of Krushevich Street, Krushevich Street, in front of Leidenman Square. The merchant Serena Marvich mentioned is somewhere around here. Okay, examine the square. Several streets lead out from the square. The wind blows rubbish around the monument to quote. Four, five, three, seven of the wise leader. The few passers-by try to hide from the drizzling rain and biting wind. The sound of music mingled with women's laughter can be heard from the righteous restaurant. Okay, I go to the monument. The pigeons of Helmer clearly appreciate gold. Four, five, three, seven of the leader. That is plain to see. Okay, poster pillar. Today, a junior medical staff orchestra of the district health department is performing a concert in pa of patriotic music in the small hall of large left outside building of the... What? Small hall of the large left outside building of the central municipal house of popular arts. Trickets, tickets have probably sold out already. Okay, how about in the restaurant? 
The Righteous is the place where the top ministers take a break from the troubles of governance. Mere mortals can only look through the windows and witness just how hard these officials need to relax after doing their duty to the motherland. Turn left. There are people in an alley selling vegetables from suburban farms. Some people still believe that vegetables from a garden are healthier than the food set supplied by Ministry of Social Care. That's the vegetable sellers. Okay. You try to find out where you can buy the things you need, but as soon as farmers realize that you don't want to buy vegetables, they stop paying attention to you immediately. Okay. Turn right. There are food stalls on the quiet street. Their range of products differs little from state-owned stores, but the origin of the goods means the buyers can haggle. Bookstore. Push the locked door several times without success. Uh huh. Bakery. Grey bread bricks on the counters don't even smell like bread. They say that bread like this is little more than sawdust and glue from the furniture factories. Butcher. Fat salesman in a dirty robe stands over an empty counter. He looks bored as he tells you that all he has left is cat food. I'ma buy some cat food, just in case. Now you have a whole can of high quality cat food. This is wise investment considering that you do not have a pet. Yeah, yeah. Return to the square. Straight ahead. You go into a blind alley. You can go into a courtyard through the gateway, but this hardly looks like a base place for doing business. Okay, inspect the dead end. There's only rubbish here. You wonder where it comes from in a time of such austerity. Go to the gateway. A huge black and white cat lies in the middle of a gateway like it owns the place. It greets you with disgruntled hiss. It arches its back, bristles its tail and yells unpleasantly. I'ma feed the cat. I have the food. The cat devours the food. Now you have a true friend in Helmer, perhaps your only one. Purring after its lover's feast, the cat jumps into a narrow passage between the buildings which you hadn't noticed before. The passage leads you to a parallel street where you spot a man in a top hat. He introduces himself as Nathan Curler and is willing to trade. Can I sell ministerial bonds? Nathan will buy the bonds for a thousand monies. Oh yeah, sell the things. And trade. I need a memory unit. What else do you have? Okay, bottle of whiskey. I still have a bottle of rum on me, so I don't need the whiskey right now. Okay, there we go. Now I have a thing for the for the shredder technician, and I can find out what happened to Hank's bro. Oh, two more hours and then I'm done with that book. That's good. Maybe I should pay some bills. Yeah, let's do that. Alrighty, now we can... Now we can finally further the plot again. And maybe I can... Somehow convince Hank to retreat from the from the promotion race possibly maybe I don't know let's see let's go upstairs and, and find the technician technician mr. technician where are you There you are. I would rather not talk right here in the noise of the shredder, but let's talk about the unit. Well, did you find it? Yes. Yes, I found you a memory unit. Probably has bad sectors. Let's see. That's a good model, sweetie, but I will like it. Can you show me the log? Just a minute, I'll replace it and read the data. What do we have here? Uh -huh. Here is the list of organic objects that entered my sweetie pie over the period when your guy went missing. Billy Milligan, Jabe Cock, 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 Stanislav from Bayer, Valeria Singh, Ines Bloom, John Kiermacher, Nicholas McBride, Emil Hart, Lillian Gibby, Oliver Whist, Mr. Fluffy, Rebecca Wald, Edwin DiMario, Kent, Kent, Odo, Odo. Is that all? 
Yes, what was the archive for? The rabbit ran out right. He's not there. Thank you, Otto. That is actually... Relieving. Task failed. What did you mean, task failed? Search the floor, search the Salvo's office. Hank's brother is still in the ministry. I need to find him. He was seen near the Salvo's office. Oh, but yeah, but the Salvo is... Talk to me. What do you want? Hank, about your brother. They found him. Rabbit Ronald is alive. They found him in Dissolve's lair. That bastard kidnapped and tortured him. The police arrested that maniac in time. I quit. Screw this place. Me and my brother will go to the farm. We've done enough work for the ministry. I see. Well, good luck to you both. Thank you, Evan. You are welcome. And now... I can go and apply for all that promotion again. The anonymous trust service welcomes you, Evan Redgrave. Select the purpose of your appeal. Apply for promotion. Congratulations, you've served our country well. A wise leader has taken note of it. You've been promoted under the workload increase program for exceptional employees. After you're promoted, you will no longer be able to access your workplace on this floor and your authority will be reset. Are you ready to move up to the next floor? Yes, I am. The work here was horrible. Initializing promotion protocol. Congratulations, you've been promoted to floor 25. Your work shift uh, starts tomorrow, I think, so now I can just go home and call Mr. John James Cunningham. Alright, calling James. Hello, James, it's Evan. I'm listening. I got a promotion. I've been transferred to the 25th floor. I never doubted you, not even for a second. Well done. A little more and you'll find yourself at the top. Start working on your next boss. Get to know him, gain his trust and find something on him. You know, the usual. Or just get your colleagues out of the way and climb up the career ladder to the next floor. I don't know what's happening in this department. Weinberg is the boss here and he's one secretive and fanatically dedicated person. Be careful. Got it, James. Okay, now... I think I have Find Dirt and Isaac Weinberg. Go to Nathan Curler's shop, Kehler's. Okay, so now I, I have the trader option there all the time. Okay, I'm just gonna read and then. Yeah, rent discount minus 60%. Lovely. But I will leave this episode of Beholder 2 right here. This might be a little bit shorter one. I don't know. But next time, we'll get to start our new job at a new floor. So, thank you all so much for watching this. If you liked it, let me know. I hope you are having a great day. And I will see you again next time.